Hello everyone. So today I'm gonna work on these detection meters for the top down to the game mode. So here, let me restart. So you will see the uh, detection meters again. The detection meters appear in the direction where the enemies are. They start to fill up as they start noticing me. They are looking some other way. Yeah, now they see me. Okay. So let's see how to do this in this episode and let me quickly remind you you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects I have done from my patreon page and also you can watch all other episodes of this series in this playlist and the characters is coming from this series so feel free to check out all of these I'll leave the links in description below right now let's see how to do detection meters for the top down all right so first to test detection let me move my character to somewhere like this oh wait no let's move one of these enemies over here so then so then i can get their attention and start detection so if i shoot they're not hearing enemy spotted oh they do they do actually the detection meter appears elsewhere so here see Fire. it's detection meters appears but it's not in the correct orientation so first let me open my detection meter it should be under pp why yeah widget detection indicator okay now here all i do is i have this uh, detection meter which is anchored here and I can rotate it using here I have under transform anger I'm changing this value to rotate it so the way I calculate this value is where do I do the calculation oh so here I all I do is just updating the angle but if I go to the place I call this I can see the calculation okay calculation happens in ALS AI controller all right let me see so here I what I do is so now I originally wrote this function for the this is how I update the angle so the way I originally wrote this function is based on the direction that we are looking at and I first calculate the direction rotation look at rotation from the character uh, to the AI character who is currently starting to detect the player and then do the delta so this is to get the rotation relative to the rotation that my character is currently looking at now this is correct for uh, this is correct for for the third person view let me collapse this set rotation okay now here this part this delta part we should get the delta related to the camera rotation because here with the camera is not changing along with the uh, controller in the top down view so and also i have here in the player controller let's get uh, game mode get current game mode yeah and here uh, this shouldn't be new parameter but what this returns is game mode and 
me update this. Okay, I'm not. So it would return either third person or top down. Right, it's updated now. And then I'll select this uh, rotation, this one based on the game mode that means here if i connect this game mode if it is third person i should consider control rotation if it is top down i should consider the camera rotation so get camera manager play camera manager get uh, rotation camera rotation and that's what I should consider now it should work See. Mm. no oh here yeah, I haven't connected it right See now yeah oh. No, it's still not correct. Ah, sorry. This should uh, I can only get this from player controller, not from the player character. So get player controller. I had connected it to the player character. Now it's correct. So here also. Yeah, see? Enemies over there. You can see the detection appear over here. Which is correct. Alright. So yeah, that's all I want to do in this episode. So thanks for watching. Let me know if you have questions in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in another episode. Goodbye.